For the second day, the city of Folsom looking more like the Wild West. Thousands of people celebrating Independence Day weekend with the Folsom Pro Rodeo. And as ABC 10's Garish Paul Sanga explains, the heat did not keep away as many people as you might think. A favorite tradition in Folsom returned for another year. We got one horse. Whether it was celebrating the red, white, and blue. This is the essence of America. Or the competition. It's the best rodeo in California right here in Folsom. It was a one-stop shop for family fun, as this Sunday brought another 7,000 people through the gates, around 21,000 total expected over the three-day period. Rodeo festivities has been a 62-year tradition of Folsom. We have a sold-out crowd every night. The crowds enjoying the classics from bucking Broncos to the colorful painted lady horse team, and even a wagon race. But the crowd's favorite did not disappoint. The sheep and the little kids are my favorite, for sure, by far. Sunday brought another day of triple-digit heat, but for some, that was the least of their worries. The heat wasn't going to keep you guys away? No, not at all. <laughs> no, I mean, I'm sweating. Back. I'm sweating my booty off. Me and these people drinking these cold drinks. It's 108 degrees out here, but we're loving it, man. While most people didn't mind the heat, there were still places for them to cool down. While most were there for an exciting time, it's opportunities the rodeo provides in the community that Shelly Martell with Hearts for Heroes appreciates. Their organization places therapy dogs at local fire stations. They give so much to us to launch our program, so we're just really excited to be here and be able to do that. And celebrate. God bless America, happy fourth. That was our Garsh Balsanga reporting. The rodeo wraps up tomorrow and it is sold out.